The driver of a trailer laden with metal fences has been arrested to assist police investigation into an accident involving a car and another trailer that left five victims burned to death at kilometer 245.2 of the North-South Expressway northbound near Kuala Kangsa early Thursday morning. Perak Police Chief Datuk Mio Farida Latrash Wahid said the 28-year-old man was detained under Section 41, Subsection 1 of the Road Transport Act 1987. The initial investigation found that the accident occurred when the car was falling behind a trailer ferrying mosaic tiles in the right lane as the left lane from kilometer 246 to kilometer 244.4 was closed for road maintenance. However, another trailer behind the car could not break in time, crashing into the back and pushing it forward until the car hit the rear of the first trailer. Following the impact, the car caught fire and the five victims were burned to death. They were identified as students of University Sultan Azlan Shah, Muhammad Nasrun Aidul Munir Akbar, age 22, Ahmad Naim Najmi Ahmad Hafizan, 21, 19-year-old Muhammad Nabil Haikal Muhammad Faris, Ahmad Akmal Ahmad Mokles, age 20, and 23-year-old Iqbal Hasnun Halimi. University Sultan Azlan Shah, Vice Chancellor Tan Sri Nordin Kardi said, the students were on the way to the university after a holiday in Ipoh. Nordin added that the university will help the victim's family by providing accommodation and other necessities until the victim's affairs were completed. The bodies of the five victims have been sent to Kuala Kangsa Hospital for post-mortem. Both the car and the first trailer were 90% burnt while the other trailer did not catch fire. The three men who boarded the two trailers were uninjured.